My name's Mark Jenkins. I'm the team principal at Slide Sports Race Engineering. We've developed a lot of the DSG equipment to be able to be used in, in competitive national level. Um, we won at many levels with the DSG gearbox. So I think they, we were their natural sort of choice. Other teams have been looking after the car and it's not a car we've built from scratch. We do build cars from scratch, but this one we've inherited and then modified. We've changed it already before we've even turned the wheel. Um, through known technology that we've proven already but um, I'm looking forward to it really because we've worked with lads who um, they weren't servicemen but they had um, a disability issues through a motorcycle accident and we developed hand controls and uh, the DSG program for that. We were approached by them um, they'd obviously um, had to use the, the, the DSG gearbox because of the various needs of the drivers so they use the uh, paddle shift gearbox with shift system on the um, steering wheel. I've done a little bit of research um, about the guys. They'll be interesting to work with. They're obviously made of very tough stuff and uh, that's where motorsport really is really. It's all right saying it's very glamorous, but uh, ultimately 24 hours is gonna be really arduous for both mechanics, team, uh, the drivers, especially with their their abilities or their, you know, their disabilities, if we like. Um, so I think they're going to going to have to call upon all their resources. So I'm quite looking forward to it, to be fair. Um, I hope to introduce a lot more engineering into their skills to try and push them even further. The thing with um, sprint racing is that everything is pushed towards going as fast as you can. The endurance racing, yes, you need to be fast, but you need to be consistently fast. So actually. Um, we need to be more efficient with everything we do. Being more efficient as a driver means you can probably relax in the car a little bit more and perhaps save some energy a bit more, which is one of the things we're going to be focusing on. When you modify a lot of um, showroom type category saloon cars, you end up with all sorts of problems. And the faster you make them go, you end up with um, issues overloading things. But any of the VAG range, the Volkswagens especially, they're so well engineered, German engineering, that you can push them beyond their normal design limits. They're good things, they're well engineered. So when you increase the levels of grip and the speed, they still stand up to it. So as a base model, yes, the Volkswagen's a good choice. We need to fulfill everybody's ambitions, first of all. That's the first thing. We ultimately, um, it's nice to be first, but for first, first you have to finish. So that's the end result of any 24 race. That's a personal victory for anybody, especially these guys. With the team as well, it's a tricky thing, but I'm sure we're up to it. We've done 24 hour racing before. Um, in short, we need to finish to start off with. Then we need to raise the bar and increase the level of performance in which we finish. So push to the end.